Hello and welcome to a new year of the Amateur Detectorist. As you may know, at the end of last year, I was starting to find some good stuff, such as two Roman coins and a dagger blade. And I'm hoping to pick up on that today, in the new year, and as of recently, I have a few contact details, and they'll be in the description box below. So let's get digging. Three oh three, a three oh three shell. It was pesky. It was in the bug again. Give me a bunch of soil. In the hole, let's just come out, so that's all right. Oh, there it is. Bloody ring ball. It's a bloody ring ball. Yeah, I think it's quite old, yeah. Could yeah. be, could be. A little bit, maybe 18th century. Possibly, yeah, yeah. yeah. Or might even be Tudor, I don't know. I'll have to get home and uh, have a look at that buckle book. Right. Just as I suspected. I just kind of gave off um, the wrong type of uh, signal for that button. Actually, you got the settings wrong. No, I've got the settings right. It's just obviously. Um... There you go, there's a button anyway. Right, next hole. Let's see what this brings up. I'm not, too, I'm not too hopeful of this one because it's um, 69-70 on the ATP and it's my turn to um, discrimination up to 60. And I'm still trying to get used to the ATP desk at the moment. By the way, if anyone's wondering, um, none of these finds are set up. What we do find is genuine finds. Otherwise, there'd be no point. There'd be no fun of it. Just dug another hole, and it's a medieval horseshoe, I think. 
medieval, post-medieval horseshoe, I'm not really sure. You can have a look for yourself. Still sort of got still got some of the nails intact. But the shape looks medieval to me, but I'm not really a horseshoe expert, so if anyone wants to tell me when they see this video, you're more than welcome to. again it's another buckle uh, there it is looks like a um, a shoe buckle or something or just a belt buckle don't know if you can see that or it might go on the hat but then that's a bit too thin really isn't it might go on a belt I think or something I don't know we'll have to have a look on the uh, the buckle book the buckle book so our first coin of the day uh, Silver, which is fantastic. It's just there. I don't know if you can see that. I think it's silver. I mean, it looks silver. <laughs> Let's get it out. Oh, that's nice. That's very nice. 1916, one shilling. That'd be George V. That's lovely. That's a lovely last year. Oh, yeah, that's fantastic, that is. Yeah, I might remember that. First shilling I found. It's very nice. Not a bad depth either, really. Not a bad depth, I mean, it come from the bottom there. Unfortunately, it's not in one piece though. Uh, it's a spectacle buckle. There we are. Unfortunately, it's broken. But at least we know in the, we're in the right uh, sort of area. Yeah, that's nice find. Okay, your next hole. It's in the plug. Just uh, scrape away some of the layers. dug the hole a bit, bit, bit deep. Double check. Yep, definitely in the plug still. Uh, also, um, if you would like to visit our webpage, we'll be doing a poll on whether you decide you like long videos or short videos, and whether you like weekly or monthly videos.